Hey there, Andrew Beard, and you may be wondering what I'm doing here sitting uh, with a tie and no shirt on, and I'll explain why. But first, I want to ask you a question. What is it that stops most business owners from getting the results that they want? And I'm going to suggest to you that it's just two things that stop them. Uh, the first thing is that they don't know the right strategies to use. Uh, and the second thing is they know the right strategy, but they don't use it. And there's a number of reasons why they don't use it. Now you might go, what a load of rubbish, don't believe you. Hey, let me use an analogy to show you exactly what I mean. And for this, I'm just going to need to run to the front door. So as you can see here, I've got a pile of sticks sitting at the front door, and that's because my brother and or my brother, my son and my daughter love to collect sticks when we go out walking. Now, if you look at these sticks, and if you think about, um, you know, say it was like 500 years ago, and we were we were down there on the beach, and we were we wanted to cook up something for dinner, then what we'd do is we'd go, oh well, we need to rub some sticks together. We need to make fire. Now, what of course we could do today is we could simply turn up with a lighter like this, and we could light it with the lighter. Um, but a couple of hundred years, 500 years ago, this wasn't possible. And so this is an example of exactly what I'm talking about, whereby if you don't have the right strategy, the right tool to use, you're not going to get the results that you want. Now this is where it gets interesting, because if you imagine that we had a time machine, and we went back in time, and we gave someone on that beach 500 years ago this lighter, would they use it? And the answer is they probably wouldn't, because they wouldn't, they, you know, it would be like a, a magic thing. It would be some sort of demon or something. They just wouldn't have confidence in it. And I think that's what happens with a lot of people today. They look at something like social media, or they look at something like partnering, and they get freaked out by it. And they go, no, I'm, I'm just going to bury my head in the sand, and I'm not going to use it. And I'm going to suggest to you that that's hurting you right now in a very, very big way. But I want to show you how you can get around this. I've got a free webinar on Tuesday night and I'd love to have you there all you need to do is hit the link below this video and put your name and email address and you can find out exactly the key strategies you can use and how to get over being afraid of the fire if you are hey I'd love to see you on the webinar have a great day Hey, here's the registration page you'll see when you click the link, and you'll see down the bottom here, just enter your first name, your last name, your email address, and click the register now. Now, the one thing that I forgot in that video is that uh, the reason I was no shirt on with a tie was because we were going to dress me up in a loincloth to record the video, you know, sort of harking back to being back in ancient times. And I uh, pretty quickly realized, although I have a lot of chest hair, I don't have enough to carry a lapel mic. That's why the tie. Now, just one last thing. You may be kind of going, oh, I'm going all right on my business. I'm not sure. Let me just ask you two questions. Number one, are you making the, the kind of money that you want to make? Uh, that's question number one. And question number two is, do you have the time off that you want to have? Because those are kind of my two big things. I want you to be able to spend more time with your family and your friends. And so if, if that's something you'd like to do, uh, then join us on the webinar on Tuesday night.